So this is my first attempt at running live through Discord. So if it's terrible, you'll just have to ignore me. Um, I am, on the other hand, trying to also record while we do this. So I'll have some pauses here and there, and we'll, we'll do some swapping around. Uh, but uh, if you happen to hop into the live, thank you for stopping by. I'm not going to see it because I have it all in background. Um, this isn't exactly the game that you would typically go live on, but, uh, you know, I'm not a typical streamer since this is my very first stream. <laughs> uh, let's go. What am I supposed to be doing again, BT? I require a third battery for full power. Without it, we may not survive through enemy territory. The IMC will grant safe passage back to the Angel City at attention. All right. I really probably need to use a different controller since this one is so buggy. Oh. Trying to do too much movement and kill myself. Yeah. Too much coffee's got my eye twitching. Let's go. I love this game. It's been so long since I played it too. And I've always played it on PS4. I've never played it on anything else. So I'm not sure if the graphics are necessarily any better than the PS4. How long did you serve with Lastimosa? Captain Lastimosa linked with me 973 days ago. Oh, snap. I hit the, the roof. Oh! <laughs> That's longer than any relationship I've had. Noted. We know there are militia survivors. Noted. Good job, BT. I think we already got this one. We have IMC search teams everywhere. The art grenades are definitely legit. probably want to take this guy out pretty early because it's a sentry and it will literally shoot from all the way over there and hit his. I'm surprised that it's letting me shoot it without attacking me. That's very strange. Stupid thing. Let's get rid of all these guys. There'll be like people shooting me out of the windows right here. So the the bad guys are basically a corporate bot. That it's it's Avatar before Avatar was Avatar, if I'm not mistaken. Those don't cook. But they have like a wide range, so they will hit for a distance. Uh, how do you say it? Uh, it's wide, <laughs> so it'll take enemies out. In, like in a, a a a whole setting, you can take out a bunch of enemies all at one time. Okay, let's see here. No enemies. There's still a guy over here. Punches or one hits, but it's because you have, again, you have like a, you have a, a power suit on that makes you more powerful. It gives you double jump. They actually explain double jump. You know where a bunch of games don't do that. You just suddenly have double jump because they want you to have it. But this game is old now. It's it's definitely not a new game, and it still looks very good. So. There is this guy. I think, if I'm not mistaken, we really won't even use it. <laughs> but I'm going to grab it anyways, just for the heck of it. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Where's he at? There he is. 
There's another one over here to the right somewhere. If you duck behind something, you can do that slide. Your healing will come back a whole lot faster. I'm telling you, that slide is its something you have to learn for this game. Well, not for the, the campaign, but for, like, if you're ever going to play online, you definitely need to learn that movement. And I'm so bad at it right now. PT, is there anyone alive on this ship? No. Scans do not detect any life signs within the MCS James McAllen. But 90% of the lifeboats have been ejected. There is still hope. So this is the ship you came in on. Screw you and the ship you came in on. You can even, like... If you get in a corner of a wall, you can just climb the wall using the corner by bouncing back and forth from one to the other. It's kind of like Ninja Gaiden style. Gaiden, however you say it. Everyone's got their way, right? I bet you the stream is just really poor quality. So even if you do happen to hop in, you're you're probably not enjoying it. <laughs> Let's be fair. I have under one megabyte upload speed. So here's your helmet. And I think, oh, I didn't look right then, but I think it said earlier that there's only two, so that would be number two. Get some of these stupid bots. You can even hack them, if I remember correctly. Those drones are IMC scouts. Enemy reinforcements will be on their way. Okay. We must complete the neural link immediately. Please install the So I guess the storyline goes something like without the neural link and full power to do the neural link, there's no way for him to, to operate independently, even though he runs independently all the time. Pilot, Not sure. We must establish a neural link in order to proceed. Please embark when ready. Yeah, boy. Let's go. Protocol one. Link to pilot. Establishing neural link. Yeah. Neural link established. Rifleman Jack Cooper, you are now confirmed as acting pilot of BT seven two seven four. Protocol 2, uphold the mission. Our orders are uh, to resume the special operations. They've been in talks of Titanfall 3 for a long time. Man, I would love to see Titanfall 3. Be great. I'm detecting incoming enemy forces. Protocol 3, protect the pilot. Reinitializing critical systems. So here we'll get like vortex missile lock on, I think. The vortex shield oh no, it's shield first. What's cool is you can even see the bullets. If you pay attention, you can see them hanging in the air. See, it's just hanging there like little missiles and whatnot. Pilot, the Acolyte pod is online. This okay. shoulder-mounted rocket pod will lock onto multiple enemy targets. The longer you hold down the button, the more locks you will achieve. So, you know, right trigger lets you just lock onto whatever enemies you want. Neural Bye! Complete. Primary weapon control and motion link reestablished.
Oh, now we get a big gun. Let's go. I wish I could have played this like on stream for the first time, like, cause I would have been super hyped. Just gotta kill a few bad guys. Oh, hey. You'll see on the screen all your your rockets there. And here we get more health, just like that. Pilot, I detect more IMC salvage teams on the way. Our only chance of survival is to uphold our mission of rendezvousing with Major Anderson. Until then, you and I are on our own. Marking your HUD. You have two bars at the bottom for your Must move quickly. Uh, speed up. Yeah, let's go. If you have never played this game and you're a fan of first-person shooters, I, I highly, highly recommend it. I got it for seven bucks originally from a yard sale. Kid went off to college, and the parents sold it, and I was like, seven bucks? I'll take it. With Major Anderson at 60 clicks from our current location. We will have to improvise and adapt if we wish And I sat on it, and uh, I'd also gotten uh, the the... It was the the Assassin's Creed, but it was Black Flag, I think, is what it was called. The the pirate one. Yeah. Take these guys down. I don't know why I'm guarding. Hit their weak points, of course. I mean, most of this is going to be pretty obvious here. Apparently, your Titan buddies just suck. You see that one right there, Tone? That's the one to have. And I'll show you, you get him in just a minute. And from then on, it'll be Tone all day. Uh, let's go back here and get some armor. So, you can also hop out, and later on, you, uh, you know what, I think you only get it in the online, but you can get um, like a grappler, kind of like uh, you get in Bionic Commando, and you can fly around the map, and it's really dope. <laughs> I mean, for me, it's really dope, I like it, I'm a fan. See all the little guys. You can squish them, or you could shoot them, or you could do, you know, first score. I'll, I'll show you first score in just a second. Just for the funsies of it. There we go. Where's this Titan at? We have another one up here. But I think they just keep coming until you get to the top. Got all these heals. Uh, let him get cover. That was dumb of me. You can use your burst to get out of sticky situations, of course. Where are you going, bro? Why are you running, bro? You can pop smoke, that'll make it to where any um, hands-on people can't attack you. Alright, so now you get your tone lo load out, and tone is really where the game makes you overpowered. Because you could just slap these dudes, you get the... It's like one of the hardest hitting, and then you have a shield in front of you to protect you, but you can shoot through it. You can also throw a sensor out that gives you faster locks and even gives you a lock. You shoot it in the air and you can go over top of uh, stuff in the middle there. Yeah, Tone is just, it, it, anyone who is new to the game, that this is the one you want. Now there are better, if you know how to play them, uh, mechs or 
whatever you want to call them, Titans. Um, but for the most part, like if you're a, a newbie, you definitely want to just rock tone for a long time. You're going to get a bunch here in the early days. We can go get this guy. You know, I'll show you all how to get him. Just for funsies. I think it was... Oh, not that way. You have to get up that pipe. Just like so. There's other ways to do it, but I always just use the wall hop. Bam. So this is another pilot who died along the way. Faceless pilot, of course. Because there's no storyline behind him, really. If I remember correctly, you can go and look at all the helmets and I'll tell you a little bit about them. Alright. And you can embark BT from a bunch of different places. Uh, you can, you know, from up top, from below. Um, in the, the online multiplayer, you can even, like, phase into them, which is really cool. Uh, we have 87% on our salvo, so once we get that, we'll be able to get through this fight a little bit faster here in a second. You'll see what I'm talking about. And, hey guys, what's up? Should have hit him. Oops. So, right there, I can do one, right? But it's better than that. You can tag both of them, and now you're going to send out rockets for both. Those, the salvo is also um, uh, tracking, just like the other. So a lot of people will just shoot it up into the air and then uh, guide it down on top of them so that they can't put their shields up and stuff like that. That's more of a multiplayer thing, though, too. I wish I'd still have the pistol. Oh, yeah, yeah, I think I get a pistol here. Something about playing games with pistols that I just like. Go. No want none, bro. How about a rocket in the face? Yep. So BT, if you watch, he'll keep defending you from over here too. Let's rocket these guys just so I'm using it. Oh. Oh, hard mode, hard mode. <laughs> you gotta remember that you're hard mode, Kermit. Uh, let's see here. Let's see how far into this video we are. Oh, we got some time. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Boom. Oh, fire stars are really good for fighting like the mechanical enemies, for fighting uh, other um, mechs, because you can basically blind the mech so that he can't get any type of locking on you and stuff like that. So that's that's very nice. The Titans, my bad, y'all. Can't even represent the game good. What's wrong with you? All right, so here's your 50 cal style sniper. You know, every game's got one. Your one hitter quitter. What are you doing, bro? Shoot him in the kneecap, kill him. You see BT's over here just lighting them up, keeping them busy for you. If we go down here, I think it takes us back to the other room. Yeah. What did I see down here? Saw another EV auto. Okay. So if you look next to the auto, you'll see it has something that looks like a magazine um, speed reload. So it's. I, no matter how you look at it, you have a, a traditional EV-8, or you can have one 
with the upgrade. So, of course, upgrade's the way you want to go. Oh yeah, there you go. There's another one. You take his own pistol from him and kill him with it. Love it. No long distance shotgun, no biggie. That guy's dead. Oop. Helps to hit. And it doesn't matter if it's, you know, if you have a lower grade shotgun, it'll always give it to you on the ground for swap. But if you don't have any, it'll it'll keep it, or, like mine is stronger than a traditional, it'll just give me the ammo and not make me wait for it. That's, that's a better way of saying it. Okay, so did we clear everybody? We don't have to clear everyone. Uh, once you get to the next scene, it'll normally just move them on. All right. So now it's going to drain out that stuff and allow him to go through. Or does it just open the door? It might just open the door. Pilot, the safety airlock has sealed you in the control room. You must find another way out. We have no choice but to split up. Anyone who's watching this who's experienced is probably looking at my Got movement you. and going, I'll trash. A nearby exit will most likely lead further into the reclamation facility. Pilot, I am tracking your location. Recommend you seek an exit. Okay, starting to get a little bit more of the hang of it again. You got to BT. You do the same. Copy that. Pilot. I like that you kind of get to have like a a back and forth with BT. Oh, there we go. So here, here's probably, I mean, next to the other pistol, for those that know, they know. I just love the pistol. Oh, don't want to get shot by a Kraber. What we have here, my IMC and militia friends, is a failure to communicate. Oh. Yeah, and I think you have to hold it for like a half second. I mean, it's been a while, so. Who was that? Accessing files. Kane, a mercenary okay. commonly affiliated with the Apex Predators, a well-known narcotics user. Y'all might know the name Apex Predators. There's a little known game called Apex. You can also, if you catch him like I, I just missed, but if you catch him with that kick, that's an instant kill. What's up, son? Uh, pistol's just so crispy. This is Kane's place. Let's go. These robots are such a pain in the dick. Excuse my language. Um, they, they're the ones you have to be careful of because of that right there. Let's go. You don't want it? That Kraber is so hard hitting. Let's go invisible. How about that in midair headshot, y'all? What's up? Friendly militia forces along your path. They may need assistance. Y'all don't want none. SRS. The line a little bit there. MGL is going to be like a grenade launcher. I think I'm going to stick with the pistol. I'm a fan. Oh, hey. I forget how to get that one. Let's see if we can't figure it out. Not too bad, huh? I, I think I've missed a few of them by now, but when I see them, I'll grab them for you guys. So, it's a waste of pistol ammo, but whatever. 
L Star's pretty good. A lot of people like it. Not for me. Like I said, I like the pistol, the shotgun. You know, same stuff I would play if I was playing Call of Duty. Oh, uh, on the back, those boxes. Those right there. You do extra damage when you hit those. Okay, so this section gets a little hairy. They'll also, if you hit them but don't kill them, it'll cause them to explode like it just did and you can end up running over the top of them and killing yourself. Get out the way. Normally, like a speed run would want you to just jump over here instantly. Oh, I hit the wrong button. That's all right. We can try that again without all the failing. So there, the way that the, the movement works is it, it wants you to slide, move, slide. It, the, the touching of the ground and then quickly getting off of it, it, it speeds you up. And that's where you throw in the slide, you do all these things, and if you keep making these correct movements you actually increase speed over and over and over it so you can get really really fast if you work at it you can use like grenades to boost your speed uh, by putting it behind you and then launching yourself off of it um, there's a few other weapons like I didn't show you in the the uh, In the, the speed trial thing at the beginning, um, there's a secret weapon that's hidden from you, but you can use that to launch yourself forward and also wipe out enemies in groups versus one at a time. Dude. Have you lost your rabbit ass mind? You see this pilot suit, yo? Bouncing off the walls each time you connect and then bounce off, it gets you going faster. There you go, there's a good example of the speed up for a second there. There's a sentry up there I gotta be careful of. Oh, he's got a pistol. Did I mention I like the pistol? Oh, I let the dude get behind me. That guy, whenever you're on like the hardest mode, uh, he, he'll he catch you a lot if you're not paying attention, which I hardly ever do. Do I not have any grenades? Did he not drop a regular pistol this time? Feels so slow from my poor movement. I love how the helmet just goes flying. Oh, there's that sentry gun I was telling y'all about. So, good way to handle the sentry is to do that guy right there. We'll just get him from up top. So I got word that there's some Vanguard class Titan and an SRS pilot taking out the Titans. Let's go. Whoever you are. Not bad at all, my friend. I just hope you're better than the last one I did. See, you can just speed through a bunch of this stuff. You know, it actually makes it easier. You know, like most games. Hell, twitchy eyes. Maybe I've been watching too many screens lately. Get out of here, son. 
Another Kraybar. Should we pick up some grenades? No, it looks like we're maxed out on fire stars. We'll stick with those. All right, let's keep moving forward. I think we're going to get close to the 30 minute mark here in a second, so. I think these are just mechanic bots, but. Let's show you yet another helmet. Let's see if I can remember how to get up there. Or the way they intend you to get up there. Because what you can do is you can get in this corner and bounce back and forth, bounce back. Yeah, bounce back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, and climb right up it without a problem. But I think this was the intended way right here. As long as you don't jump yourself right back off. And another helmet found. Pilot, exercise caution. This sewage will hurt you. You too, BT. Where are you? I'm following the stream of sludge. So, yeah. Here. I like Fallen Order too, and it's got some of these same style around the wall mechanics, so I'm, I might be playing some of that eventually as well. Oh. Alright. Pilot, our paths will intersect just up ahead. Another helmet acquired, and I'm gonna kill myself on sewage. Missing me already? I, was not I love the back and forth banter between be the two of them. Of <laughs> Never mind. What's up, BT? Long time no see, BT. On the contrary, your helmet provided me with a live feed of your actions. You fought well out there, pilot. The controls to deactivate the sludge flower in the next chamber mark in your HUD live out in the country and winter is when the cedars love to pollinate. I am security forces. Oh, that guy didn't die? Get out of here with that. You'll see that knife again in the future. Oh! What? Okay. I deserve that. I was getting a little too reckless. This is... This spot in the game specifically is where almost everyone is starting to get a little uh, like a new player that is you start to get really confident at this point and they throw everything in the kitchen sink at you because of that and you'll see it on time back here in just a second if they start adding stuff oh what was that long distance <laughs> elbow bro get out of here okay And you can shoot while sliding if you're, you know, not bad like me. Oh, he's coming down. We should be very afraid. Oh, throat shot, huh? Get out of here. Bunch of shoulder shots. Just to show how bad I am. Pump shutdown sequence at 20%. Steal his pistol, use all the ammo, throw it out. Oh, here we go, here we go. Those things get close to you and then go off on proximity. And they're nasty little buggers. And they just keep coming. So, let's see. A lot of times, what I'll do, uh, depending on you know what I'm trying to accomplish in the game, is I'll run over here, get them to jump up on this ledge right there, and then they'll start. And you can just jump off and 
can get away from most of them. Oh. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> Got them Floyd hands. What's up? Get out of here. So another thing is, if you shoot them too close to you, obviously they're they're bombs, so they can wreck your uh, house. Oh. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Let me get. Is this a timing thing? I think this is a timing. We have to survive for so long, and then BT can come in and save the day. I think BT is going to be here any minute. Yeah, 50% I think is what she just said. Oh! So, uh, here is an example of how to fail epically. You'll see those those uh, fire stars. They're really good at, at at causing those things to explode, and can be very, very, very helpful. Like you can drop it. Like when you know they're going to be right here, you can just drop it right there, and it'll cause all of them to get caught and explode right there. Kind of protect your back for a second. Gotta love the <laughs> executions. Hey boy. Let's go. Okay, so now we can see BT. So all we need to do is figure out how to get over there, right? Life is always better whenever you have a giant machine to help save you. Uh, oh no! Oh, I'm gonna die from this stupid stuff. There we go. How did I mess that up so bad? Probably just going the completely wrong way. But now BT's over here just slaying them one shots. You know, I've never gone this way, and I think that's probably the way they intended for you to go. Alright. Uphold the mission. Uphold the mission. To resume special operation 217. Rendezvous with Major Anderson of the SRS. Everything's already been wiped out over here. Oh, wait. There we go. You were not invited to Kane's party. And that's why you're dead. <laughs> Well, well. Now they're runaway here. So, type. should we get a little crazy with it? Well, now should I go off. steal some <laughs> some uh, power ups from these guys? He's got Scorch, so if he gets close to you, he can be very, very mean. Walk away, Scrub, just walk away. Only a matter of time before I rip you out of that cockpit anyway. Let's go. When you have a sonar, I think it'll double hit if you hit him right. 
like I said, it's been a while. Eat side of the on me. Oh no, I missed. It didn't let me jump on top of him. There we go. So if you get on top of them, you hit square or X if you're on whatever you do, the rodeo, and you literally take a whole health bar from them, you can then jump back into your Titan and get your health bar for him instead. Oh, I could have done a, a, a special kill on him too. Oh, wow. Anyways, well done, Pilot. that's how you rodeo. Kane's helmet radio is still intact. We should retrieve it. Let's go. They didn't want none. Let's see. 40 minutes? It's not too bad. We, we might call this episode and, uh... Yeah, we'll probably call this episode here in just a second once we finish this mission up and start up another one. Uh, those who are sitting in the live, I'm sorry I can't see any of your chats. I'm gonna have to figure out how all that works and maybe minimize my screen so I can see it and at least respond to you guys. Yeah, you, know, you have to understand this is literally the first uh, live stream I've ever done. And I didn't even do it through YouTube, I did it through Discord. And there's only seven of y'all, I think, in my Discord, so I don't expect y'all to actually show up just yet. The ability to decrypt enemy communications. So you see this little round spot on top? This will work to our You can literally drop into your spot through there. I'm not supposed to be on top of BT right now. All right, we're gonna call that an episode, guys. Uh, thank you for checking out the video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I know I, I'm i still working on my, uh, in my personality on stream. It's new for me, so I uh, appreciate y'all hanging in there. Uh, let's see here. If I hit the right buttons, it would help, huh?